short of withdrawing the current finance bill, the country we know as Kenya will have technically collapsed to the joy of the colonial neocolonialists. They will then embark on exploiting of our natural resources, which are many, without any word or caution from any Kenyan. Another indicator of a regime keen of corrupting Kenya is the bipartisan talks. They have now been on for 50 days. These talks are a waste of time. It's a tactic by KK of buying time before the final slaughter of uh, the opposition and multi-party democracy as we know it today in Kenya. Again, it will be very easy for our resources to be exploited in this country without the opposition having a say in any of that exercise. A third indicator of a, a, a team keen on corrupting the country is the systematic capture of our uh, public institution, including the public service. This will ensure that any dissenting voice is killed before it is heard, and the neocolonialists will again exploit our natural resources without a word from any Kenyan, a Congo in the making. The caregenerization of the public institution and again the public service is yet another step towards corrupting this country totally. We have seen this before. This is what happened in Rwanda before Kagame came into power. A clear indicator of a people who want to corrupt this country. We now have seen the reawakening of the Mugeki uh, type spirit by the KK regime. A tactic that has been used in the past to ensure that families and especially those without the fatherhood figure or the father figure, their sons are chased aloud, made less stress, and the end result is a leadership gap that is created in those communities. A step again towards inheriting the affected communities to make it easy for them to be exploited and their resources to be exploited without a say uh, from the affected uh, people. All these things are not happening by mistake. They are by design. They know what they want to achieve. We have been here before as a country. We have seen other countries in Africa go through this route. We will not allow it to happen. Happy Madaraka Day.